Howdy everyone, doing another tier list today and it's the dragons from Dragon's Den. Gear up, get ready, we're about to go in the den. Alrighty, as always we have our lovely dragons across the bottom. First up we have Deborah Meaden. I don't quite know where to start with Deborah because I think I'm madly in love with her. I want to be humiliated by Deborah in a sexual sense. I want her to manhandle me and pin my legs behind my head. I want to be told off by you, Deborah, after I've burnt your steak or I've bought the wrong wine. Shout at me. I do. I'm actually quite smart. So yeah, Deborah, stunning lady, stunning woman, legend. I'm sexually attracted to her. S. Boss bitch. Duncan Bannertine, another legend. I don't know if you saw him in Jungle with Lady C, but he shut her down somewhat shocking and I were here for it. Well done, Dunk. Side note, I've met Duncan Bannertine on Magaluf Strip, believe it or not. If you don't believe me, here's a picture to prove it. Me and my mate Duncan, out and about. Bannertine's the name, and don't wear it out. Maga strip were coming, no stopping us. Me and my mate Duncan were coming for your drugs, Duncan, 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 Duncan. Duncan. I might do another video about that because that were a pretty ace night. Um, and so I'll leave it there. I will do another video about that. Stay tuned. S. Because I've parted with him in Magaluf, for fuck's sake, what else do you need? And he can party, let me just say that. <laughs> Hilary DeVay. Now, when researching this, I found out she died. If you read Hilary's story, it's a complete rags to riches. She is a boss, boss bitch. A boss bitch. But she's dead. So, eh. Hey. I'm out! Okay, we have... The cash machine queen herself, Jenny Campbell. Jenny's another very sexually attractive woman. However, as opposed to Deborah, I'd want to dominate Jenny. So I don't know what that says about me. I want Deborah to pin my legs back, and I want to pin Jenny Campbell's legs back. If we can make that in some sort of a chain, I'd be up for it and it'd be a great night. Oh, that tickles. Jenny's another boss bitch, a northern gal. She's going to go A. No disrespect to her. Uh, I just feel like, you know, she came in for two seasons, sacked it all off, she's done. Respect it, but don't know really enough. She ain't got that longevity to really judge her on, which I think's fair. But Jenny, cracking pair, love. Get here now. Peter Jones, longest standing dragon since season one. I think they're on about 20 now, 20 seasons. Recently appeared in Shark Tank as well, which was a nice, uh, nice little surprise. What you notice over the years um, is... Everyone who goes in there wants Peter. You know, in the little start bit, they're like, who's your ideal dragon, Peter? Of course it's Peter. Another one with a great story, puts them to the grill, and what I like about Peter, he's not afraid to stand up to the rest of them. He's not a sheep. S. S for that, Pete. Tej Lauvani took over his family pharmaceutical business, I think. Tej is very much the strong, silent type. His eyes hold a lot of mystery. Fuck me, Tej. Fuck me. Always well dressed. I prefer his suits to any other, I think. But he's in the pharmaceutical game, so how good of a person can he really be? Ask yourself that. B, but that's not based on his suit wearing abilities. <laughs> Theo Pathetis. Boss man, one of OGs. He came on it very early on. Theo and Deborah have come a long way together. They've got shared investments. So has him and Peter. There's a famous story for those in the know. They walked into a pub for some tea one night and a couple of drinks. They ended up buying the fucking pub together. So, Theo, admire his bollocks. S. He's on S for bollock factor alone. Tuka Sullivan, the luxury fashion designer. My guy. <laughs> now, he's not a designer. He runs a clothing line. I don't know if that'll be a difference, will it? Yeah. I don't think he actually designs things, but he creates luxury brands. He's very good at it. To be honest, I don't really see him as that bad. Sometimes, though, I have noticed with Tuka that he gets the wrong end of the stick quite a bit. 
and some of the other dragons might have to correct him on occasion. So, um, for that, he doesn't quite make the top tier, but he's here in great company with Hillary and Jenny. Just a little inside scoop as well. Hillary hated Duncan. If anyone saw that Loose Women appearance, you'll know exactly what I mean, and I'm sure a lot of you have. So, yeah, keep tuned about the Duncan video, because I will do another video about when I met Duncan Bannatyne in Magaluf, and that will be coming in the next couple of weeks. Keep an eye out for that. It's a great story, great tale. Apart from that, we've done the dragons. Good night. God bless. Look after your dragons. Me and my mate Duncan Out and about Bandatine's the name And don't wear it out